Hello Collective, welcome back to the Ascender Divination Priestess channel. You are greatly appreciated. I am sending you all lots of love, joy, peace, and happiness. Many, many blessings to you and your families as always. I return to source, I return to sender. All negative energies and intent immediately and permanently. I call in only the pillars of white light and pray that you stay only in the highest of vibrational energies. Whatever the enemy has stolen from you, it is returned to you. All evil and negative plans of the enemies against you are dismantled and being dismantled as we speak. As I have said, so shall it be. Listen, folks, there's somebody out here that is planning on causing more manipulation. This is a manipulator on a mission to cause more manipulation, uh, forcing something to go in their way. Someone is still behind here, behind the scenes, bribing, wanting to force an ending for you, okay? Um, and the most high is not having it. As you can see, we're starting out here with the six of uh, wands, which has to do with you having victory, success, okay? You being a logical thinker, you overcoming your enemies, basically, okay? So someone is still paying to have you be defeated. So they can't defeat you naturally. They cannot play fair. Uh, playing fair is not a, a word in the game. It's not the name of the game for this person. So they are paying to have something go in their way. This is something they're doing from behind the scenes. This is a secret that a whole community is not supposed to know or someone is not supposed to know. Some type of reckless action is being taken towards the King of Pentacles. You may want to be careful because they're trying to have you in prison. They want to have you trapped in some type of situation. So you have no choice but to give some type of offer to an unhinged creature uh, that you know you don't got no business to be dealing with uh, because you know someone is unfit. This is the person that's been paying behind the scenes to have something go in their favor. You are strong as hell because you're coming up as a Leo out here investing, right? Uh, you don't got to be a Leo, but your strength, your tenacity to get away from a situation due to you knowing the truth, uh, due to you having foresight because you're someone who's a thinker, who's a planner, uh, very uh, much insightful, right? Um, you are leaving a situation to give a solid commitment to someone else that you have chosen, right? Um, now, I don't know what this has to do with. Maybe it's the fact that people don't want you partnering up with someone. I said, I don't know what it has to do with split my deck and it ended up on the full, followed by the wheel of fortune. That means that you're stepping out on faith to have some type of destiny play out or to bring balance into a situation. You want things moving in the forward direction between you and another party. Now, if you are a king of pentacles in the reverse, baby, we ain't talking about you. Don't be out here pretending like we're talking about you because it's a manipulative man out here. That say he does not care if a feminine energy likes him or not. He is still going to make sure that they come together. Baby, you and that woman ain't never coming together. You ain't never coming together. Someone may have some type of mental illness. And he is determined to prove to his friends, colleagues, that he and you have a calling together have a contract together if you did it's been void that contract is over because someone is a cold-blooded narcissist uh someone has mental illness uh, if people don't know that maybe they're gonna find out i'm telling you someone is a narcissist going through a tower financial like financial insecurity the whole group is going through it but they're still causing illusions out here when it comes to you being the originator or creator originator look at you my darling being the originator of something, okay, the innovator, the in in inventor of something. They still want to act like something ain't yours. Maybe it's yours, it's yours. This is, they know, they know. This. Look at you. Look at you, girl. Sir, the, you know, the universe does not play about you. They don't play about you. You're out here balanced, you, just doing your thing. And the, all the forces of the universe are backing you up. Your ancestors included, soul guys, angels, everybody. Even Rod himself is shining that rays. Listen, even the moon. Listen, everybody is on your side. And they said they are making sure you end this chapter successfully because you don't invest it a lot into your path, your contract. Yeah, baby, your, they say your contract is so intact. It couldn't be more intact if there was ever more in, more tech. I don't even know what to say. They say your contract is intact. You are abundant, so you need to walk out here in confidence. Let go of fear. 
leave that to the karmics. Leave the heartbreaks to the karmics because these people are afraid of you having some type of new beginning. You moving on, and you will, guess what? You're going to have wish fulfillment out here. All to me fulfill. Baby, look at you. Oh, look at girl. Sir, 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 sir. When you when you're a, when you reach a pinnacles, you plan to reach. Uh huh, uh huh. And there's a sister that got a channel that you know did some readings for you and things like that. Don't forget about this channel. Ten of Pentacles, Ten of Cups. Listen, the universe ain't playing about you. Solid commitment coming in. Make sure you go with the right person because they got some type of nutcase that's planning to come towards you. Okay, going through some type of five of pentacles energy and he's trying to force a relationship with you. Baby, I told you your victory. Your victory is coming in quick. Quick. Okay, you are victorious. They said they don't want you to be seen, being heard, taken seriously. And that's everything you're about to have. Envy. And it's about to piss these people off because people have invested a lot of money into taking you down, into blocking you. It is what it is. It is what it is. They're all watching you. The haters are watching. Okay. Anyways, baby. Victory coming in for the Queen of Swords. Stepping out on faith. Stepping out on hope. Having a brand new passionate beginning. Still in connection to Source. Communicating with Source on 24-7 basis. Because that's how we do in the spiritual community. Listen, we got to add a little bit of humor out here. Out here, skill as heck about to be uh, collaborating with like-minded people as yourself. You may create your own soul tribe or you're about to meet your own soul tribe. And it's going to lead to a lot of opportunities and options and offers for you. Just be cautious of the one you choose. You don't want to be out here heartbroken and having to walk away due to you ending up with the wrong crew. But you know your people. You know your people. You feel your people on a soul level and an emotional level. So, baby, you will know your people. You're someone with a lot of insight. There's someone in the background of you. Maybe you're not aware of them. Yeah, you're not aware of this person, but you're listening to your intuition. They may be going through some type of regrets for trying to steal something from you. Now they're burdened because the truth is being illuminated and you are moving forward victoriously, accelerating and things like that. And you are healed and balanced is what this person is trying, is starting to figure out, right? It's also something where someone may be embarrassed because they were helping people trap you. Okay, people are in some type of mental imprisonment, some type of uh, anger. Uh, I don't know even how to call this because the truth, baby, is out here. Bold. You're having a new beginning. They are trying to cause more illusions about this beginning, this new beginning. People are angry. People are jealous. Baby, that don't got nothing to do with us. L listen, light workers, <laughs> gather up the fruits of your labor with no type of shame. Be shameless about it. Be shameless. Okay? You didn't do anything to be ashamed of. Okay? You didn't do nothing to be ashamed of. So you take on, take all your, uh, the, take all the fruits of your labor. Okay? And enjoy them. Uh, let, let's see, I'm writing down my uh, title because I'm so tired of forgetting these titles when I'm uh, trying to upload these videos. Because now I just be like, you know, we're just going to name this video this. Because I don't remember what the heck I was saying in this video. And I ain't going back to watch the video. So it is what it is. Anyways, people is, people are out here mad because of you. You're still investing in you. You are still determined to end this chapter. Listening to your intuition. Baby, in contact with your intuition is so intact. It's scary. You could have people out here that are very much afraid of you because they cannot come towards you and just tell you any kind of BS. Because your intuition, baby, it might as well just be called your mind at this point because the both of you are so intact and mingle with one another. There's no separation. Someone's intuition is open 24-7. Seven. And that don't mean it's open to the rest of the world. It just means someone is very alert. And people are pissed off about this. Someone may be very jealous of a connection you may have with someone. Someone may be jealous of some type of business you have. They want a piece of that business. It don't got nothing to do with them. This is just someone who's a cold-blooded narcissist that's in some type of denial. You could have someone else on the other end that has a lot of desires to partner up with you. But whoever I'm picking up on, 
On the other end is a narcissist that wants to have a hand in your business that you are working on. Something you manifested by yourself. Someone else wants to come in and invest in that business with you. But someone, uh, uh, queen, a king of swords reverse wants to come in and destroy that business because you don't want to partner up with this person. You don't want to partner up with this person. And whoever this uh, father figure, boss figure, baby, baby, baby. The, the police are on you. They are stuck on you like white on rice. <laughs> they know exactly what you've been doing. They know that you were paid to do something or you've been paying. You were either paid by a queen of cups, queen of wands, reverse and reverse to do someone something. So they know exactly what you're planning. You are going to the penitentiary. You may want to start writing your farewell letters because you may end up serving anywhere from 12 to 15 years because of something you've been doing that you think nobody is aware of. You're a cold-blooded narcissist. You're in denial. Denial is a river in Egypt. You don't think you're going to be busted. You don't know the police is already onto you. They're looking right into you and that woman that's been paying you to do something. Okay? And you're going to have a hard time, baby. I, I think you're in like your early to mid-50s. No more than no more than 55. And you are fixing to go do time when you should be fixing to be retired and living your life. But you've been out here doing odd jobs um, to get yourself locked up. So, you, baby, you go to, to what? To jail or prison at, at 50, 55. You're looking to be about 70, a little over 70 when you come out. Uh-huh. Oh, uh, who? Uh, 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 uh. If you got grandkids, you may want to take the time to enjoy your time with those grandkids. If you got children, you may want to take the time to enjoy your time with those children, because you're about to be doing some hardcore time, and you're gonna meet the real bad boys in there. You think you're a bad boy? Don't worry, the real ones are in there They're waiting for you. You know they don't like people that do things to uh, women and children. So you're going to have a real hard time in there. You, you did what to a woman? Uh, what? Uh, you popped up to a woman's house to do what? You did what now? Oh, okay. Whole plot line going up against you in that penitentiary. You're going to get it. Listen, you're going to get this sin. You're going to get it. Oh, you're going to get it. <clears throat> You, you best you best rethink your choices in life talking about you're gonna pop I, I looked into you a little bit talking about you're gonna pop up to a feminine energy's house make them feel uncomfortable gonna uh, break into their home or you're gonna try to kidnap one of their kids and stuff like that so you can have them living in fear and force them to be in a relationship with you what's wrong with you you got a mental illness you are this desperate to have some type of attachment to someone's money someone's abundance and they don't got nothing to do with you. Are you crazy? You got to be. You got to be. You're mentally ill. People don't know that. People don't know that. Maybe people don't know what you've been doing behind the scenes. And what I'm picking up on, it ain't nothing pretty. You're, you're the man I've been picking up on that is hacking into systems and things like that. Blocking people's money. Blocking communications and things of that nature. You're going to the penitentiary. Everybody that's been working with you, they may want to walk away and try to figure their lives out. Balance their situations out. Go invest in themselves. Listen, a lot of you are wasting your time with these kind of narcissists, these kind of people. Don't know that you could build a, a whole business for yourself. Okay? Build a whole business for yourself. Invest in yourself and move on with your life. Live your best life. It just takes a little bit of time to get the business off the ground. But baby, nothing that's worth your time is easy. It ain't easy. Yeah, find that strength to walk away. Because whoever has been out here telling y'all they're going to end up with a feminine energy, they ain't ending up together. That woman don't want that man. He, she's repulsed by him. And he said he don't care if she don't like him or not. They are still, he said they're still coming together. Baby, it's a lie. I told you all this is a narcissist going through a tower. Because whoever that feminine energy is, things will be balanced out for them in due time. You are being investigated. Wasting your time out here, telling us, oh, yeah, just we just watch, just give it a little bit of a little bit more time. This is someone who's a planner. I got her, I got her. Y'all gonna see, we're gonna end up together. I'm gonna have her. no, you're not, you're not, you're not. Listen, someone's 
as far as a feminine energy is concerned, it's 911 on site for you. 911 on site. So you better move away. Move on. You're out here planning on sneaking a feminine energy to take from them. Okay, you're unhinged. You're out of control. You need to prioritize the things that matter to you in life at this time of your life. Okay? And it don't got nothing to be to do with coming in to a feminine energy's life to mislead them, to gaslight them, pretend like you're you or you're genuinely interested in them. That woman don't give two Fs. If you're you, if you ain't you, that woman don't want nothing to do with you. Leave her alone. You see how she's... Uh, listen, this queen of source is out here with the fool's energy. Meaning she is looking forward to the future. Hopeful as can be. Don't got nothing to do with you. Ain't bothered by you or nothing. Leave her be. As a matter of fact, someone said she forgot about the past. The past is behind her. You see the little bit of wool she's taking with her? Baby, I can, I can trust and believe that you're not in that. That sack right there that that fool is having on his shoulder, the woes that pertain to you, it's not even on her mind. You probably don't even exist in this woman's life. She's too focused on herself, okay, on her life. So whoever is partner up with this madman that keeps telling you that he and someone will end up together, they ain't finna end up together. That man is shameless. Shameless. This man has some type of urge to be with a woman that don't got no time for him today, tomorrow, or any other time in the future, in any lifetime, in any dimension. They are not together. She said, oh, heck no. Oh, heck no. We are not uh, coming together. That someone is the opposite of the masculine that's trying to force himself with her. This is a genuine energy he's trying to force. And all this man does is plot and plan on how he can come towards this woman. How he can cause her some type of discomfort. They want you. He wants you to be uncomfortable. This is someone that's been accepting bribery behind the scenes and working really hard to make your life difficult. Stealing from you. Blocking you. Lying. Smearing your character. Invading your privacy. And listen, I'm telling you, this queen of swords here... Baby, this woman is moving forward to wish fulfillment, ultimate fulfillment, new life, new beginning, everything. But to have a whole family or already has a family, won't nobody know. Leave this woman alone. She ain't worried about you. Don't be worried about her. You're not going to have, have any type of collaboration with this woman. Not today, not tomorrow, not anytime. Because this woman and her ancestors don't got, do not have time for you and yours. Today, tomorrow, or any day. They say you got them fucked up in one and too many ways because your energy is just too nasty. They don't want to be part of it. They don't want to be associated with it. You just don't know how to learn uh, life lessons. You're being investigated, fixing to go to the penitentiary. I'm telling you, <clears throat> working with a whole family, working with a whole group, a whole couple out here trying to steal from someone. And you're under judgment. Look at you. Right into poverty. Right into poverty. You are fixing to lose everything. Someone may have committed some type of fraud, financial fraud behind the scenes. And I think this is what uh, uh, brought the justice system's attention to him. Because someone is very desperate for money. It don't matter how much of it he has in his bank account. He'll do anything for money anything and he still thinks you two are going to partner up and have this ten of pentacles but this is a des destiny with somebody else this is something you work really hard for so you're going to have it but just with someone that's like-minded as yourself okay like-minded as yourself there's something going on in the court system and you're going to win collective if it's against this brute that i'm picking up on you're going to win they were trying to steal something from you Whoever you are, man or woman, you know exactly what these people are doing. You know exactly what they're doing. But whoever this unhinged creature is, with the urge to be a part of your life, he said he don't care how, any way, any how, he wants to be a part of your life. It's a no-no for your ancestors. They said just as committed as he is to blocking your future, blocking your fulfillment, 
They are committed <laughs> to wreaking havoc in his life. <laughs> oh, this man said he does not want you having any of your abundance, your birthrights, what's destined to you. But maybe you're consistently showing up as what you need to. A wholesome. <laughs> Someone does not like the fact that you're wholesome. They don't like that you're wholesome. They want you to be karmic. They said they want you to be karmic. Excuse me, I'm writing down the titles of my videos because I can't keep doing this no more. I can't keep doing it, folks. Every video, I forget the name of the title. The name of, what, what am I going to name this video? I forget. <laughs> so, we're writing it down. But anyway, whoever this man said he wants to have a, a connection to you, you got a lot of money attached to you, whether this is money you don't know about or whether this is money you are building on your own. He said, oh, you and him are going to be together. And your ancestor says, that's a absolutely <laughs> no. That's absolutely no. No. As far as they're concerned, <laughs> okay, as far as you, as far as your ancestors are concerned, this is him on site every day. Anytime he tries to temper with you, this is him. This is it, sir. You best go find something better to do with your time. You know, live the rest of your life in peace because whatever it is you're planning to do to a feminine energy is going to backfire. It's going to backfire. It's going to lead to this for you. And it came back out the same, you all. Okay. Endings. Uh, endings. Endings. Anyways, thank you all for watching. Stay blessed. I'll see you in the next week. Goodbye for now.